Okay, so you've got six work offsets, 54, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And this one, the external one, overrides all the offsets. So anything you put in there will affect every single offset by that amount. So if we put a 1 in that C-axis move, that would effectively mean that that's like 46, and that one would be, uh, uh, that would be adding one onto there, so that would make that like minus 34. So it's moving everything by that master amount, so that's what that one's used for. These work offsets are using the machine position to set it, so that means when the machine position was 45, that's where that is zero so if you Im import g55 c0 that will zero up at that 45 as a machine position in the program you've got g10 the g10 is this line and that will write a work offset l2 means write a work offset to offset number three which is g56 there and um, they're the figures that it's going to import. So it's going to write, overwrite the G56 offset. So even if you alter this, it doesn't matter what you put in there, the program will overwrite it with that. So each time you read the beginning of the program, this will be import. So you must be aware that if you change it here, it will only be, it'll only be relevant until you reset the program and read the beginning of the program, and it will be overwritten.